Hello everyone. Today I have another design. Uh, it is another Flying Ice Cream Incorporated, as you can see. It is a flying ice cream cone. So, it is a scout, does not have any guns, but it has a, a tier 7 uh, radar j receiver, a tier 7 radar jammer, and a tier 5 enemy radar. Also has a flipper at tier 5, because I didn't know what tier I'd need. So basically this design, if you want to build it yourself, it's as simple as you just build t too long, you go up, and then you go up, wait no, hang on. So you build too long, for example, you could have too long, then you go up, and, hang on. yeah, so too long, then you, actually basically be three long, you go three long again, and you'd go three long again, and then you'd make that, yeah, I ran out of brown cubes, then you'd kind of make that in a 3D shape to get this. So basically, end is one block long. It's kind of showing you how to make it here. The end is one block long. And you would go around. Now for this demonstration, I'm just going to use these blocks. So the end is one block. Here we go around. You would go around again, but the same shape. Now you have this, but now you're gonna go out one. Let's pretend we have this all filled out, and like pretend we have it all the way around. But then you go the same distance out. So for example, it'd be two out, then two. Well, it's the same length for same width around for two. Then two. Then you go out one. Then you go two. Then you go out one. Then you go two. Then you go out one. Uh, just kind of hard to for me to explain here. Can't fi figure out the right words, but I guess you kind of get the gist if you look at it. And there's only one block. So this is a tier 5 aileron, tier 5 rudders, and as we said before, tier 7 radar. These are all tier 2 thrusters, and this is a tier 4 thruster. Yes, tier 4 thruster. These are tier 6 thrusters and some tier 2s. And these are for some reverse thrusters. In case we get stuck, we don't have to always use that. And so we just go backwards. Assuming those don't get shot off. And so this is all just white blocks and a, and a tier 1 white blocks. This is a tier 7 red block. Tier 8 red block. And behind the tier 8 red block is a tier 6 helium. That's to make sure the front doesn't drop as much. And it actually flies really well. And I'll show you right now in a quick battle. Or a practice battle. This is a tier 5, so it can be shot. Flies quite nicely. Once you get up in the air, it'll cut, drop very slightly. As you can see, I'm not going down or up. I just kind of dropping very slightly. Then kind of evens out. Drop, and then still dropping very slowly. I know it doesn't seem to drop anymore once it hits this point. But it flies around quite nicely, not too maneuverable though. I guess you could add guns to this yourself, but I just didn't. Because I don't really have any room. All it is really to me is just a scout. It's flying ice cream incorporated. Very slow maneuverability as you can see. And this is what the first thrusters are for. And then we can go right back up. What's wrong with the sun? You guys see that in the corner? The sun kind of like... Looks like it's almost out of your render distance unless you look at it in the corner. Yeah, it's like out of your render distance. That's weird. I guess one thing you could do if there was an enemy right here and not look paying attention, you could just go ram him. But that was a bad ram. Because <laughs> it didn't even hit him. Dang it, I wish the spotting mechanics didn't have to get exactly on them. Because some, some guys are really small. It's harder to aim at them, especially when you're high up. I 
so this is it. The only problem is it gets shot down. So it makes it kind of a bad scout, but I just use it for fun. Haven't even used it very much yet, just if I want to have some fun. So this is my flying ice cream cone. I don't know if I should name it that. And this is it. That's all I have for now. Um, so thank you for watching. And I'll, I'll see you on the battlefield.